Hi, I'm Kevin with Baxter Performance, and this is the front cover to a 2.7 liter EcoBoost engine. Now it has a cartridge filter located right here, and the oil cooler would be located here. But what happens with this engine is it totally drains back in about 18 minutes. And let me show you how. So now this is the inside of the cover, and you can see with this plate off here that the oil comes up from the oil pump travels up here, goes out to the cooler, comes back in, and then travels over to the oil filter area where it floods the oil filter and then continues on to this outfeed port and there would be a down tube here and feed the main oil galley just above the crank. Now this oil system is equipped with no anti-drain back valve or any kind of check valve to maintain the oil in the filter and the cooler all the way back down to the pump. So every time you shut off your engine after about 18 minutes, this is totally drained out of the front, plus it's drained back through the cooler and all the way back down to the pump. Now your owner's manual will tell you to wait 15 minutes before checking your oil level, and this is why, because it's totally draining out. But there's some mechanics out there that'll tell you that it's because of the way the heads are built and everything, it takes a while for the oil to totally get back down into the sump. Well, that's not true. It's really the oil system that's totally draining back. Most engine wear occurs at cold startup, and that's no secret, but having a prolonged dry start really exacerbates the problem and makes it even worse. But we have a solution. The Baxter Performance has introduced a cartridge to spin on oil filter adapter that allows you to take advantage of the anti-drain back valve found in most spin on oil filters. Plus, it has an outflow check valve that opens on the inside of the adapter to keep oil retained in the filter from the outflow side. So once our adapter is installed, you can simply spin on your spin on oil filter now, we're, like I said, we're not only taking advantage of the anti-drain back valve that's inside, but also the outflow check valve. So we're keeping the entire system from the filter all the way back through the oil cooler, all the way down to the pump. So it doesn't have to make up for that volume every time you start your engine. So once this is all installed, you've started your engine, this is all filled with oil, what are you gonna do with oil change? You can't just simply take the oil filter off because it'd make a big mess, right? Well, we've included a Schrader valve so that you can blow it down with compressed air for about three seconds before your oil change, and that evacuates the oil filter completely. So when you remove it, it doesn't spill a drop. So be sure to check us out. Go to our website at baxterperformanceusa.com. Again, that's baxterperformanceusa.com. I'm Kevin with Baxter Performance. Oil System Solutions. Thanks for watching.